On this week's program, we continue our visit to the RVIA show in Louisville, Kentucky, where Jeff and Ivan check out what's new in Toy Haulers. And Ivan pays a visit to the Tentford booth. These stories and more on this week's Rolling On TV. Closed and Spanish captioning, where available, is sponsored by Jayco. At Jayco, we've been making family dreams come true since 1968. Toy haulers are one of the fastest growing segments in the RV industry, and they come in all sizes and price ranges. Let's join Evan as she checks out an entry-level toy hauler from Gulfstream. I'm with Randy Baskerville from Gulfstream Coach, and we're here in front of this beautiful, one of their entry-level toy haulers. Hi, Randy. How are you today? Couldn't be a better day. This is a gorgeous entry-level toy hauler, and they are just all the rage today. So tell me a little bit about it. You betcha. We're a 35-year-old company in uh, Napanee, Indiana, Gulfstream mm -hmm. Coach, and we've been produ producing the track and trail probably for uh, 10 years now. And uh, we brought this 24-foot uh, uh, to the uh, National RV Show here in Louisville and very excited to share this uh, product with our dealers. Is the track and trail always a toy hauler? Uh, yes, always a toy hauler. And uh, what we've done with this is an entry level uh, with the metal size and we have the silver color with some great decals on it. And the outside speakers and the electric awning is very appealing and very good uh, curb appeal. You notice also we have the black diamond plate with the with the gray wheels on it as well so 15 inch tires very stable very strong let's go inside and check it out sounds great all right come on so here we are in the heart of the toy hauler what is this called this is the toy room the toy room absolutely Rocket. and it's gorgeous tell me about it yep what we got here is we actually have a uh, dovetail so we can bring two fully dressed harleys in here place them in here and one of the great things we do at Gulfstream in this track and trail is we don't set the mounts on this until you bring your toys in so once the toys come in we know where you're going to set weight distribution all that then we do the tie downs and custom all your tie downs to each toy that you have. So what if my toys aren't Harleys? There's other toys that people bring in these, right? Great question. Yes, we have uh, dog groomers uh, going with our product. We have antique people, uh, just about anything that you could ever think of. And then we also have this pull down screen. So oh. when you're out there with your toys, you can pull this all the way down and then it'll keep all the bugs out. So it's great livability nice. as well. And then nice. we go into the two sofas we have here that flip down. And then we mm -hmm. also have the bed that will come down for more sleeping. So two, four, six, very easily right here in the toy room. So Wow, sleep six here in the toy room? That's right. Great, great wow. amount of room. Now, I love to cook, mm -hmm. so I don't have a Harley, but I do have one heck of a chef's knife. And here's your kitchen, so tell me about this. There we go. We have a double door refrigerator. That's very important. And then uh, two doors ah, here. Merci. Yep. Lots of room in there. Oh, yeah. And then you right. also have a double double bowl sink there. Mm -hmm. And then you have an oven, mm -hmm. which a lot of them just have the oven top. So a full oven in here, so mm -hmm. you can have all your biscuits. And then you have your microwave above as well. Mm -hmm. And mm -hmm. cabinet, cabinet, cabinet three throughout. And then you also have your tread plate on the bottom. So at the end of the day, you can just wash everything out right out the back end, nice oh, and clean. Oh, that's great. So, so when people bring their toys in here, it might get a little dirty, sandy, grassy, because we're riding the dunes. That's right. Of course. So just and really. Nice and clean. How and then you also have a ventilator there, and then over here on the bottom. So that, that opens up and then gets all the, any of the carbons out as you travel or you have oh, your toys up there with you. So no safety kidding. is very important to us here at Gulfstream Coach. Wow, I hadn't even considered Absolutely. having a ventilator. Interesting. Yep. Now, right. not only do we have the toy box and the gorgeous residential style kitchen, but we also have a bedroom and yeah, a bathroom. Absolutely. Let's right? go take a look. Let's check it out. Well, we come in this uh, area and it's a private bath and private bedroom with the hard door. So this seals everything off from the toy area. So you have your lab here and then your uh, private bathroom, oh toilet, and shower. There's a shower in here. Absolutely. Oh, it's nice because it's so tall. Yep. You could really, I mean, wow. And the natural skylight inside as well. Fantastic. Fantastic. And then you also come in here with a nice double bed right up front here and then a great wardrobe closet. Wow. 
That's then, great. Then in front, uh, running uh, east and west, is a full storage area lighted for all your toys and your uh, all the accessories you want to bring. Outside, through. pass yes, through? That's correct. So, is that the mother in law cottage? <laughs> that's right. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> oh, shh, we didn't say that. <laughs> well, this is terrific. This is absolutely livable, fun, and exciting. What else have you got? Yeah, well, just like the Leno in here is Congolium Leno. It comes with a three year warranty. It looks like hardwood. Yes, and a magic mark or anything, a scuff mark comes right up. No, just wipes clean. Nice. Uh, the roof is a uh, 12 year rubber roof warranty. The floor decking is actually a 10 year warranty underneath there, all five eighths, one piece. Mm -hmm. So it's very, very strong mm -hmm. and yet very affordable. This one uh, goes to the marketplace for 21.9, and then the 17-footer, a little bit smaller, I was telling you about, that actually goes to the marketplace for 16.9. Now that's a good price for a good-sized toy hauler. Coming up after the break, Jeff checks out a top-of-the-line toy hauler from Jayco. We'll be right back. Simply put, Thetford's AquaCam has outsold all its competitors combined because it's the strongest holding tank deodorant available. It provides the strongest odor control around the clock in all temperatures and conditions. It quickly liquefies waste and tissue and is 100% biodegradable. AquaCam, the industry standard for 50 years. For more information, visit Thetford.com. AquaCam, another great product from Thetford. Never run out of propane again. With Level Check, there's no more guesswork. Just run the gauge over the tank, and when the light turns from red to green, you'll know exactly how much propane you have left. It's that simple. Level Check, another great product from Truma. For more information, visit levelcheck.com. This is something else. It's, it's great. Uh, it never ceases to amaze me how far these rigs have come. It's so much fun. You can look at all this space. Look at the ceiling height, slide out room height, 50 inch TV, fireplace, wow. sound bar. Gotta have a fireplace. When Gotta you're have camping. a fireplace. Yeah. 5200 BTUs of heat. Wow. So wow. pretty amazing. And that's the fireplace, of course, is electric. It requires is. plugging in. That's okay. Right. No gas. No. no gas. Small details. Yes. But, and uh, this kitchen, I can think of a particular wife of mine who would find this kitchen just delightful. That is some countertop space right yeah. there, yes. And, and this uh, is a solid surface of some kind? This is a signature series Corian right here. This is okay. a definitely an expensive upgraded countertop, but it's for mm -hmm. the ladies, right? Yeah, yeah. And it looks like authentic uh, uh, genuine is, tile black backsplash. That's new, that is all uh, genuine stone, it's polished mm -hmm. glass. Uh, mm -hmm. You notice how high we brought it up right there. See how we brought the uh, countertop all the way up. Three okay. inch backsplash yeah. as well to match. Very Real resi residential. Very yes, residential. Sir. Yes, yeah. yes. And the refrigerator looks like a uh, residential type. Yeah. 23 yeah. cubic foot. Wow. Also has ice and water in it too. You don't see that very often in them. A lot of guys mm -hmm. are just doing, you know, the, the yeah. traditional ones, but all digital display. Yeah, Frigidaire wow. name brand, so. And this uh, this sofa unit, uh, it, clearly it looks like, uh, is it is it also fold out? I mean, is it a, a, the, the recliner Residential, type thing? Residential, recliners, leather, everybody mm. can kick their feet back. Wow, very cool. And then obviously when you're looking up at the ceiling, mm -hmm. um, there's this large panel here that, that's, that lights up. And ceiling the, feature right yeah. here, yeah. It's just, it's decorative, mm -hmm. you know, otherwise you just have a white ceiling, right? Yeah. But uh, you can notice all the uh, LED lights extra in here, but we spread them out really well, I think, and distribute the light and... Uh, well, the LEDs bright. are smart. They're, they, and they're not the heat. Good reason for them. Yes, sir. And then you look toward the back, of course, and you got that neat little storage loft whatever area up there Bones I mean for the kids I, I can sleeping. think of some nieces that uh, would really like that yes kids love it they're up and down that ladder all day long it seems like but it's also a great place for bonus storage wow, nice looking bedroom plenty of headroom even well I'm I'm six six and I'm six two about got enough for the for the average six guy foot five. yeah yeah yes, so a beautiful bedspread very eye-catching thank good. you yeah, that's good looking thanks for noticing I will and, tell you it's a kind of a funny story but these are actually the same design that's on my throw pillars at home in my house. Yeah. Um, to have a custom look and something yeah. unique just to seismic, mm -hmm. this is uh, digitally printed. 
Yeah. It's wow. laser etched and it is matching our shower curtain as well. And so cool. all of the seismic customers, yeah. this will be unique just to them. Nobody else in the industry will have wow. it. So. Well, the woodwork in here is gorgeous. Very nice residential looking sliding door there with the mirrors and so on. Thank and you. Uh, I'm looking at the, this, this it's bed, a nice foot of the of bed cabinet and there's a strange looking cutout in there. So that <laughs> Yes, there is. Uh, oh, okay. What? Well, I will tell you this awesome window right here. Uh, look at all the natural light. But, uh, you know, when the customers come in, and we do that, that's a 40 inch LED right there. Very Nobody's nice. Nobody's ever done that before, and that's a, that's a seismic first. So what's, uh, what's the story out here? Well, take a peek, check that out. Wow, this is uh, something we haven't seen before. Isn't this great? Yeah, what do you call this? This is just an extension of the living room. It's just a side patio. Mm -hmm. the, the whole thought process is you're on the ground camping, correct? Mm -hmm. Why mm -hmm. not just bring you up off the ground? You're not walking in and out of the steps all the time. Mm -hmm. In, out, just an extension of the living room right out the really side. Really nice. And it looks like you have the entertainment features out here as well. Another 40 inch uh, LED, outside speakers, refrigerator. It is all covered underneath the awning. Yeah, very nice. Pretty cool feature. Thank you. After the break, we'll join Jeff and check out the Seismic's large, plush garage area. Is it now the perfect time to turn your old pop-up tent trailer from looking like this to looking like this? Treat yourself and your family to a bug-free camping season with a new tent canvas from Canvas Replacements. To learn more or to order a new canvas, visit canvasreplacements.com or call 800-232-2079. Be sure and visit the new RollingOnTV.com where you'll find weekly shows along with a selection of videos, stories, information, and the latest RV news. Our lifestyle pages are full of great stories about places to go, things to do, and what's new. Written by our viewers and RV writers from around the country. And if you're into great food and drinks, then visit our food and beverage pages where we'll get your taste buds up and ready for an Epicurean adventure. All this and more on the new RollingOnTV.com. Now that we've seen how large and luxurious the Seismic's main living area is, let's check out that garage. All right, back here to the good stuff. Yes. Wow, this, uh, this looks about as far away from what you would imagine in a toy hauler could possibly Thank be. Thank uh, you, that's our goal. I mean, residential, 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 right? Mm -hmm. um, if you notice the paneling that we put up instead of the diamond plate, it's yeah, just an extension of the living scotting, room. Yeah. Uh -huh. Got the... Uh, uh, chair rail, we have the oversized windows, you can see all the storage, another 32 inch LED TV. Yeah. Can't, Can't have, have too many TVs, eh? Too Four TVs. standard. Yeah. So, oh, wow. here's one of the other things that most people aren't expecting. Second full bathroom. Wow, very cool. Great place when the kids come in, hose them down. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. How about dogs? You bring yeah. your pets in, you don't have to bring them all the way up to your bathroom up front. Oh, yeah. So it's a neat little feature. Put that, the old uh, towel down to keep them. And yes. these, uh, these sofas, uh, they fold down, I guess, into a bed? They do. Those are rear convertible sofas. They fold down, make mm -hmm. it to another queen bed. Wow. You have another queen bed up yeah. top. Yeah, the, the, the drop down mechanism. Correct. Bed. You just Powered. push a button, everything's power. Oh, very cool. Very simple. And the, um, the screen door back there, it looks like uh, this lets you close it off against the bugs and so on. We refer to it as a three seasons room. Mm -hmm. uh, just uh, you can extend your camping as well. You have obviously another 15,000 air conditioner, wow. BTU yeah. air conditioner. You have AC, you have heat ducts, screen right here. But at the same time, when you're ready to bring your toys in, they just fold completely wow. out, drive your toys in, shut it behind you. Mm -hmm. It also comes with plastic that Velcro's on, so it keeps all the heat cold transfer from going right out through the screen as well. So oh, that's cool. why they call it a three season room. You literally nice. can be back here in three seasons. Yeah, you can be here in the fall when the air gets a little cool and enjoy yes. the looks. But, yes. And it looks like the uh, the deck out there, or the ramp picks up to make another outdoor deck, sort of like the one on the Once side. Once again, you just extend your living space out the back, you extend it out the side. I mean, think how many square foot that you have to work with. Yeah. Also has an electric awning. You have your own remote control electric awning as well so like I said control, we're trying to make it easy on yeah. you okay yeah. <laughs> wow this is very nice thank you well thank you very much for the look around uh, I really good appreciate stuff. it thank you nice to see you again there's a lot of products that go along with owning an RV and one of the most important ones is something most folks don't talk about much coming up after the break Ivan visits the Tentford booth mm -hmm. 
At Jayco, we're a lot more than just an RV manufacturer. We're all about family. And we've been making family dreams come true since 1968. To see our complete product line and find your nearest Jayco dealer, visit us online at jayco.com or just log on to rollingontv.com. At Norcole, we realize that some of your favorite RV destinations are off the grid. And Norcole refrigerators are uniquely designed with that RV experience in mind. We call it Freedom Unplugged. To learn more about our Norcole RV refrigerator line or to find a dealer near you, visit our website at norcole.com. Here we are in front of your AquaCam display. It's awfully colorful, but I think it takes care of something else that's kind of awful. Yes, AquaCam is a holding tank deodorant. And we know that people do not want holding tank odors coming from their holding tanks. So AquaChem is the strongest odor control available. Wow. We have it available in many different uh, forms. We have it in liquid. We have it in very convenient toss-in packets. Um, hmm. A variety of forms for the customer to choose from. Now, does it come in different scents or is it unscented? It does come in different scents. Uh, we're offering some new scents, uh, some very clean scents. Um, one is a powder fresh, one is called Morning Sky, which has like a very clean cotton fragrance to it. Um, so yeah, we have uh, a variety of scents to choose from. And rumor on the street has it that your chemist is a female. She is, she is. Um, we, uh, we have a full chemistry staff at Thetford, and we're always looking to make our products better. We have, um, in our chem lab, um, we're always evaluating how to make the strongest odor control available, and AquaChem really does deliver that. Great. Well, it's a terrific product. It's got a great name, and uh, thank you very much. Thank you. Wow, Andy, I can't believe this selection. There's so many different choices. What's up with that? Yes, this is what we call our toilet tree. Toilet and tree. This is a this is a display <laughs> that you will find in RV retailers around North America. And it's a really great display to help consumers uh, pick and choose which is the best toilet for them. We have a, a, a wide variety of toilets to choose from. Uh, very lightweight, durable uh, toilets. Uh, up to uh, very home-like ceramic um, type of toilets. Wow, unbelievable. So a lot of different flushing mechanisms. Um, wow, got it all. Now what else have we got over here? Yes, we have uh, some different types of toilets. We, we offer toilets for all kinds of vehicles. And some of the vehicles uh, don't have a traditional holding tank underneath them. Uh, Pop-up trailers, for example, do not have a holding tank underneath them. Uh, so we offer a what we call a bench style cassette toilet. Uh, this is a fully self-contained toilet. Um, it has a holding tank within it, which is the cassette. Um, and as that holding tank fills up, the consumer, the RVer, can simply uh, take that uh, holding tank and empty it in a conventional toilet uh, if they don't have access to a sewer port. You know, I'm familiar with this because this is exactly what we had in our little motor home when we were in Australia. Is the it? set toilet. And, you yeah. know, at first it seems a little bit daunting, like, oh, what do I do? Easy, easy, yeah. easy. Yeah, it's very popular in Europe and in Australia, but it also is uh, installed in some of the RVs here in North America. That's terrific. And you've got one more behind you. This yes. is a funky looking like yes. a pod. This is what we call our porta potty curve. And many people don't know that Thetford is the uh, owner of the registered trademark Porta Potty. Oh, really? Um, yes, we own that trademark name. And this is a Porta Potty right here. This is a deluxe model Porta Potty. Uh, we call it the Curve. Um, it's, it's really got all the bells and whistles. It's got holding tank indicators for the fresh water and the wastewater. Uh, one of the neatest parts about this is it's got a built in toilet <laughs> tissue holder right there. So. That's really clever. Yeah. Where would you take this? Would this be in an RV? Or? You know, this has a lot of different uses. Um, people that use, uh, that go tent camping, um, 
uh, perhaps uh, tent uh, pop-up tent uh, owners that don't have a cassette could use a porta potty. Uh, we also find that people will buy these for bedside use or anywhere that they need some portable toileting, uh, they can use a porta potty. I'm thinking even I've got a friend who has a music studio in the woods. This would even work for that. Perfect. Wonderful. All right. Well, there is still more to see. Unbelievable. So let's go check out what else you've got in your booth here. All right. Okay. Come on. Hi ho, hi ho. It's off to we go. Actually, this is a really cool product. Andy, come over here and tell us about this. Now, you guys are the sanitation experts, and we've seen your wonderful chemicals, we've seen your fantastic toiletry, and this is something different. It's called a tote. What is a tote? Yes, uh, a tote tank is a, uh, a portable uh, tank to hold waste from either a black water holding tank or a gray water tank. And if you're at a campsite that doesn't have a dump station nearby, but your tanks fill up, you can empty your holding tanks into one of these portable waste tanks and then tote it to a sewer. Mm -hmm. And I imagine that that is a perfect thing to use when you're at a national park, a state park, or somewhere beautiful that maybe you want to enjoy everything, but it doesn't have the hookups, even if you do have yeah. a full-on. Yeah. yeah, they're very convenient. You don't have to break camp to go empty your holding tanks. You can simply use one of these portable waste tanks. So this one is a gigantor, so it's got some special features, I think, is that yes, right? Yes, this is a new model that we're coming out with in 2015. We're very excited about, about it. Uh, Thetford has been in the holding tank business, the portable holding tank business, for about seven or eight years now, and this is going to be our second generation. We call it Smart Tote 2. Um, there's, it's got some really cool features, uh, one of which is it's got a, a compartment here to keep everything nice and neat and stored during storage. Um, so um, everything is here when you need to fill your tank or empty it. Uh, there's a sewer hose, five foot sewer hose that's permanently attached. Um, it comes with a 90 degree sewer nozzle with a handle to allow you to connect it to the hose right, right, uh, right. when you're dumping into the sewer. Um, and then when you're done, everything simply stores in this compartment. There you go. Close this up and you're good to go. And all you do then is just grab your little handle like so and hi-ho, hi-ho. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's it for this week's show. And if you'd like more information on anything you saw on the show, along with additional videos and stories, visit us online at rollingontv.com. For the latest up-to-the-minute RV news, visit our media partners at rvbusiness.com. For great recipes and RVing tips, be sure to visit Ivan Schmatter at thervcookingshow.com. And now, we'll leave you with a few clips of another fun production. I want to give it a try. All right. Oh, wait, no. I think so. <laughs> Wait, I can see. That's a problem. She, let's just say she's already in here. Let's yeah. use that phrase. Yeah. <laughs> Are Correct. you blushing, Jeff? Correct. Right. Hey, Dan, don't look at this camera, by the way. Sorry. Ignore this one. This is, this is a... D oh, okay. Oops. No, that's okay. Laugh <laughs> in your face. <laughs> no, no, no. All right, so is my hair straight? Take a step back so I can look at you. Okay. Get your, your shirt, put it that way. There you go. Okay. Yeah, so it so I mean so my fat hair doesn't hang out. Well, I mean, you, yeah. you know. Yeah. Why don't I slide in? Yes, yeah. Okay. Yes. Are you when ready? it comes to somebody fitting in a spot, you slide in. <laughs> it, no, it's the stomach that needs the work, okay? Just pretend that, uh, you know, simple isn't over your shoulder making faces. It's okay. In two minutes, when I go to my meeting, he'll be doing this. Okay. Oh, that got him out of the way. <laughs> uh, well, yeah, okay, the yeah, bring it up. Oh, bring it up about bring here. Bring it up a little higher. Let's, yeah. let's take that whole piece over. Okay, let's go and start say. out there and then say, okay, we roll. Oh, wait, leave it up again. Okay, now hold it. <laughs> stop right there. Stop. Hold still. Okay. And as well, a nice solid refrigerator. <laughs> Cut. Perhaps a lovely glass of wine. Joe, you know the cue to give her? Yeah, he's got a cue for me, all right. Michael, 
Shut the camera off.